Dangerous flash flooding has led to a local emergency declaration. High water in Henry County blocked off several roads, including Route 220. 10 News reporter Taj Simmons is live tonight. He's been following this all day. How's it look out there right now, Taj? Well, I'm happy to say it looks a lot better now than it did this morning. I'm on Route 220. It's open now, but for the longest part of the day, it was closed right where I am, north of the Route 57 interchange. All that's left of the flooding now is mud and dust. It's a far cry from the impromptu lake that formed here earlier this morning. The water here drowned out cars and seeped into houses along the road. Henry County was drenched with rain both overnight and early this morning. The county's public safety chief said that double shot of rain directly led to the flooding, but he did not expect Route 220 to get washed away. I don't ever recall it being that high. And uh, I've worked and lived in this community all my life. And uh, I'm not going to say that it's never happened, but uh, I've never seen it to the level that it was this morning. The water started receding at around noon, after which VDOT worked to clean up the mess. The public safety chief also said that the flash flooding was constrained to this part of the county, the Bassett, Stanley Town, Bassett Forks area of North Henry County. Coming up at 6, I'll tell you how these flash floods are helping prepare his department for any future emergencies. For now, reporting live in Henry County, Todd Simmons, 10 News, working for you.